Hello, Fairy Neverland readers. I am so happy to be back in Paris and to see some of my old friends here. And I'm sad that I missed some of you, but I hope you like the new book, Pour Anjou avec toi. There's a lot of Paris in it and a lot of France in it, which makes me very scared that you'll like it or not like it, but you'll just have to read it to find out. And as always, I love coming here. It's so wonderful. So I look forward to the next time. And merci, and adieu. Everything that don't make sense about me Makes sense when I'm with you Like everything that's green, girl, I need you But it's more than one and one makes two Put aside the math and the logic of it You gotta know you Cause I wanna wrap you up Wanna kiss your lips I, I wanna make you feel wanted I wanna call you mine Wanna hold your hand forever Never let you forget it Yeah, I, I wanna make you feel It's a little off the beaten path neighborhood for a lot of people, but it's the part in the book where Allison uh, randomly points to a metro stop, and the metro stop is Chateau Rouge, and it winds up being this neighborhood which is very interesting and diverse. It's very Middle Eastern and very African, and she and Willem walk around and they wind up in this park. And it's very important what happens in this park for a couple of reasons. For one reason, they fall asleep, they, they take a nap in this park. Before that happens, they have this conversation, and they don't, again, reveal that much about themselves, but certain things get revealed, which is that Willem is alone, and that he has to take care of himself, and that Allison is burdened by time, and it, Willem takes the watch away from her, and Allison jokes that she'll take care of him, and these things seem to be kind of a flirtation, but they're also very important, and then they fall asleep. And then they wake up and something's happened between them. Allison can really feel it. Before anything happens, they hear a scream from over on the other side of the park over there. You can't see it now, but at that point, they race over, or Willem does at first, and there's a couple of skinheads and they're hassling a couple of girls in headscarves. And what happens there has some big uh, ramifications for later on in the book. And it uh, motivates Allison to a moment of, of bravery that's sort of new for herself and I think is a real game changer for here. So a lot happens in this book, in this little park, this little sliver of a park in a Parisian neighborhood. That's where I have to go To see your beautiful face anymore I stare at a picture of you And listen to the radio Oh, hope there's a conversation We both admit we had it good But until then it's alienation I know that much is understood and realize if you ask me how I'm doing, I would say I'm doing just fine. I would die and say it's your night on my mind. But I go out and I sit down at a table set for two. And finally, I'm forced to face the truth. Say I'm not over you No 
even close without you If you ever